Hello everybody. Today I want to give you a quick unboxing of this eye selector. It is for iPhone 6 and 6S. Basically this case is waterproof, dirt proof, ice proof, shock proof, and scratch proof. Now if I turn the box over, you can see that it says that it is IP68 at water and dust rated. And under waterproof, it says it can be submersed in up to two meters of water. Two meters, it's that is 6.6 .6 feet for up to one hour. And also, if you look down here under shockproof, it can, it can survive the drop at the altitude of 1.5 meters. So let me go ahead and open this up. Now, I already opened this up, so I know exactly what I'm talking about when I pull this out. So we have a strap here, which you don't even really need, but I'll show you what it's for in a second. And then I'll pull the case out of stuff and it comes with this little, this is actually replaces the flathead screwdriver, okay? Because if you look on the back of here, there's basically two screws that you have to unscrew, okay? Then it pops up just like that. I'll show you that one second. But of course it comes with a manual here. And this core basically goes around your neck. You can actually keep the little screwdriver. You can keep it on here. You can strap that on here. And then when you want to screw it, unscrew it or whatever, you can actually take this off as well, just like that. Uh, for me, I'm not even going to be using this. So let me just go ahead and put this back in here. And here's the actual case. You can see there's a protection back here and there's also a protection back here. Comes with two screws here, power button, and down here. Now, these are rubber bumpers here as well. And if you open this end up here, you can see that the headphone jack is here. And on the other side of this, this should be the lightning port, which it fits perfectly. I've already tested this. So let's go ahead and open this up, and I'll show you how to put it together, and then we'll, I'll do some swiping, open the camera, and We'll see, if, see how the volume works on here. So let me go ahead and unscrew this. I'm not gonna use this because this is gonna, this takes takes me forever, okay? It's easier for me to just use a regular flathead screwdriver. So let me go ahead and... I think that's good enough. And then once you unscrew these two screws, you just pop your fingernail in this groove here and pop it up in the back. Okay, yeah. So this part comes up first, okay? Just like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. And here's the uh, inside. There's a lot of these uh, little stubbies in here, all around the edges here, which you need to pop all those back in here when we put this back together. And let me go ahead and open this up here. Okay, this screen actually was on, on here. I took that off of there. And I'm gonna take this part off of here as well. Okay. Take this part, this film here, and there's like a screen protector that's on here. Of course, there's something on here under the home button as well. And on here, there is a protector on here as well. And basically, you can see the inside of it here. And how we put the phone in, you simply just grab your phone, iPhone 6 or a 6S. This is a 6S here. Just put it in like that, and it fits nice and snug in there just like that. And grab the back of the case and place that on top, just like this. And you want to make sure all these are in the grooves on the sides here. Okay, and you got to make sure you hear a click. Make sure every single one of these is clamped down. You can see. Just like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and tighten the screws up here. All right, there we go. Nice and tight. I'm going to go ahead and turn this over. And let's see how the swiping feels on here. Perfect, no problems here at all. Uh, we can go ahead and click on the sleep button here, put it back on, 
let me go ahead and log in again. Volume rockers up, down, no problem. The lightning port fits in here perfectly as well. And also, you know, if you're gonna be dropping, going in water, you wanna make sure that these flaps are closed, okay? And let's go ahead and see if we can hear the speakers no problem. Let me go ahead and open up YouTube. Here is a video. Now this is actually an updated video because uh, some people had issues about uh, exporting it. It would show up as a... Uh, no problems there with the speakers. You can hear it perfectly fine. Let's go ahead and open up the camera. Make sure the holes are okay with the camera. Yeah, no problem here. Let's do a front facing camera. No problem there at all. And it seems uh, pretty sturdy, nice in the hands. Definitely a case that you can use uh, actually all day long. But I mean, the big thing is, is it actually waterproof? And I'm gonna do that test uh, after this video here. So if you link, look below, the link for the water test should be on there. And that's pretty much it for this video. If you have questions or any comments, and if you subscribe, share, like, I appreciate it. And I'll put a link below on Amazon where I got this as well. Okay, thanks. Bye.